Potenko, what are you doing? Are you get sick? Up. Come on, hey, Potenko, wake Come on. up! Come on. Shut up! I'm trying to sleep! Huh? Everything feels like broken glass. Why won't you leave me alone? Let me do what I want! I'm sorry. I just wanna rip everyone's hearts apart! What's wrong with him? This isn't the usual transformation formula. Kotenko's been going into major mood swings all day. His poor little heart can't take it. Is he gonna be okay? Why are you worrying, sis? The queen can just transform him back to normal. Well, aren't you smart? I wish that was how it worked. Kotenko transforms when the bad side of his heart overtakes him. Usually I'd be able to reverse his transformation with a fresh halo, but that won't have any effect on him if his heart is this unstable. Well, I zoned out, what'd she say? God, Nappa, you're so rude today. Do you have any idea what could be causing him to react this violently? Well, you guys were five minutes late to showing up to play with him today. Huh? What do you mean? Kotenko actually used to have these outbursts a lot before he met you two. It might not be perfect, but I'd say him spending time with you keeps the bad side of his heart at ease. Well, now that we're here, he should transform back to normal any minute, right? This isn't like a regular mood swing that eventually burns itself out, but there is... one thing. What thing? Buried deep below in the bowels of the great Deku Tree's cousin is a sacred lake that produces Kotenko's favorite grape juice only once a year. If he drinks it, surely the balance of his heart will revert back to normal. Huh, sounds kind of stupid when you lay it out like that. Yeah, it really is. There's no need to worry, though. Mumu has a secret stash of it in case of an emergency like this. Ah, your majesty, I got terrible news, you hear? Uh. I'll show you as soon as we cut to the next scene, you hear? Uh, okay. <laughs> what in heaven's name? We can't just stand here. Call Don and have him grab this year's grape juice. Don't you remember Don's on vacation in off-screenville right now? Well, then call Ronald. He's too busy with his job at McDonald's to handle something like this, you know? Oh, fine. We're gonna have to find someone else then. Gotcha. Just who could have done something this awful, though? Was it the Baron? No, I think it was someone far worse. I found this at the scene of the crime, you see. I know that, Feather. There's no way. Are you sure this is a good idea, sis? We don't even really know where the grape juice is exactly. We can't just sit around and do nothing like everyone else. We're going inside of that tree. Yeah, but... Weren't you listening to Queen's backstory about Kotenko? You guys already know how this will affect him being the future king of heaven. It's hard enough keeping this a secret from everyone, and Kotenko himself. Though, he wasn't always like this. We actually forgot to buy party supplies for his first birthday. While everyone was gone, he had one of his feathers stolen and taken to the Ground Kingdom. The Great Demon King cursed it with his evil power and Matenko was born. I'm still trying to figure out how a newborn angel's feather ties to their heart, but yeah, my baby is cursed. Oh yeah, I must have zoned out during that too. <laughs> no intruders to report! Sort Uh... The queen didn't mention anything about this place being guarded. Huh, well, here goes nothing. That was easy. Let's try going this way. Are you sure this is the right way? Yeah, there should be a lake up ahead somewhere. Hey, who drew these ugly faces on the trees? Now's not the time to be distracted. Come on! <laughs> hey, wait up! Oh my god, what is the matter with you? Get away from us! <laughs> hey, it's that emo guy from the other episode. Oh, hi, Rue. Oh, this is the second time I've met you guys so far from your home. Why don't you make like a tree and leaf? Yeah, that one was awful. What are you doing here, anyway? Well, you see... Oh, I know what you're talking about. That stuff only comes around once a year. Yeah, and we need to give it to our friend Kotenko as soon as we can! Kotenko, huh? Huh? Oh, it's nothing. This Kotenko just seems very important to you. Well, yeah, he's my best friend. Yeah. It would be a shame if something happened to him. 
Hey, what are those? Huh? Oh, cave jellies. Wow, creative name. I remember having one as a pet and it really enjoyed eating small winged creatures. Um, could you maybe shoo them away from us then? Yeah, please do. If you insist. Here, hold this for a second. Ah! 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 Die! Die! <laughs> die, die, all of you, die! <laughs> hey, Rue! Hmm? What's wrong? We just wanted you to scare them off, not kill them! Oh, sorry. I just couldn't help but get an adrenaline rush to the sounds of the helpless screeches as their insignificant little souls left their bodies. <laughs> Why do I feel like we're in more danger now? You go. You have a safe trip back now. Thanks so much for your help. All right, Nappa, let's head back to the castle now. Yeah. Can we get something to eat on the way? No, oh, come on now. We gotta hurry. Oh. <laughs> I'll be. Oh my jeepers, I don't believe it, but it really is the grape juice, you know? We can talk about what happened later. Let's just give him the juice already. Hurry, my arms are getting tired. Well, alrighty then. Open up now, kiddo. Once I'm through with you, I'll pin you to the ground and rip out your... <laughs> what? What the... What are you all doing in my room? Thank goodness, my child is all right. We won't have to worry about Matenko for a while now. Uh -huh. Huh? Transform, baby! Finally! I don't know what was taking me so long to get up, and now I can finally start having fun! <laughs> that window looks breakable! <laughs> Wait a minute, this isn't the grape juice! Yeah. This is grape soda from the Ground Kingdom that went flat a week ago, you hear? Now his heart's balance is even more out of whack than it was before, you know? But how can that be? Maybe Rue confused the cape for another one. Did you say Rue? Eh? Huh? Huh? Uh, what's with those reactions? Rue is one of Kotenko's older brothers. Huh? However... Rue's not a good noodle like the other brothers, you know? In fact, he was the one who helped the Great Demon King put the curse on Kotenko, you hear? We had no idea. Oh, great. What are we gonna do now? Use Kool-Aid? Oh, God. <laughs> Hope you guys have a great rest of your lives. <laughs> <laughs>